Add in three minutes. Let's begin. Walter White, a mild-mannered high school chemistry teacher, is diagnosed with cancer. He informs his wife, Skyler, his son, Walter Jr., and his brother-in-law, DEA agent, Hank. Walt joins Hank on a drug bust and discovers Jesse Pinkman, a former student of his, is running his own meth lab. Walt finds Jesse and offers to cook crystal meth if Jesse can distribute it. The duo creates and sells their first batch, barely escaping both the long arm of the law and the guns of the gangsters they sell to. Their meth hits the streets and becomes an overnight sensation. It is 99.1% chemically pure and is nicknamed Blue Sky. In order to conceal his identity and protect his family, Walt creates the alias of Heisenberg. Walt and Jesse begin dealing to an unstable distributor named Tuco, who is famous for killing his own men. Hank survives an IED placed by the cartel that kills several other DEA agents and tarnishes the new promotion he received from killing Tuco. Jesse falls in love with a heroin addict named Jane. Jane begins to manipulate Jesse and turns him against Walt. As their relationship develops, so do their drug habits. Jane's father, an air traffic controller, attempts to put a stop to the relationship. He fails. Walter watches Jane die and chooses not to save her. Walt attempts to leave with a bang, selling a massive amount of meth in one deal. He arranges a meeting with mega distributor Gus Fring. Gus presents Walt with an offer he can't refuse, money and safety. Walter agrees if Jesse is allowed in. Hank is attacked by cartel assassins, the cousins of the late Tuco, and hospitalized as a result. During Hank's recovery, Jesse and Walt kill associates of Gus Fring. Becoming annoyed with their antics and instability, Gus hires a replacement chemist, Gale. In order to save Walt's life, Jesse kills Gale to ensure Gus has no other meth cook. Walt attempts to get closer to Gus, but all of his attempts fail. Gus manipulates Jesse and turns him against Walt, forcing Walt to back off. At the same time, Gus assassinates the entire Mexican cartel and establishes himself as the ultimate drug lord kingpin. Walt convinces the only surviving member of the cartel, Tuco's uncle Tio, to blow himself up in order to kill Gus. Walt and Jesse destroy Gus's lab. They team up with Mike, Gus's ex-security head, to jumpstart a new operation. All of Mike's old associates who worked with Gus have been rounded up by the DEA. Walt demands a list of names for Mike so he can kill Mike's soldiers in prison. Mike refuses, so Walt kills Mike. Walt contacts the Aryan Brotherhood to kill Mike's associates in prison. Hank discovers Walt is Heisenberg and confronts him. Jesse realizes he has been manipulated by Walt for years and agrees to help Hank catch Walt. Walt, Hank, and Jesse end up in a standoff with members of the Aryan Brotherhood. Hank Hank is killed, and Jesse is made into a permanent meth slave. Walt makes sure that his money will be given to his family upon his death, then prepares to murder the Aryan Brotherhood. Walt sacrifices himself to save Jesse, and murders the entirety of the Aryan Brotherhood. Jesse escapes. Walter dies of a self-inflicted wound in the Aryan Brotherhood's meth lab. And that's it for 